Combat in the Wild is brought to you in part by Mossy Creek Game Calls, Spectre Shot, Jeb's Precision Chokes, HuntExchange.com, H and H Timber, and these other fine sponsors. Boom jam! You are the... Well, this year we got the opportunity to do something that I've always wanted to do. We got to go up to the Prairie Pothole region in North Dakota in October. It was actually right on the Canada line and do some duck hunting, do some dry field hunting. It's, it's always been a dream of mine to go up there, so we packed up. I actually got on an airplane and uh, I suckered some of the rest of the guys into driving. Uh, it was about a 33 hour drive, so they were good and ill when they got there, but once we saw all the ducks flying around when we got there, everybody, everybody calmed down pretty quick. Well, we got there and we met up with a good buddy of ours, Scotty Lehman. He's actually got an outfitting service in Tennessee called Elk River Outfitters. And during the October lull during deer season, he kind of takes a break from deer season and goes out there to North Dakota. And he actually invited us to come on this trip last year at the NWTF convention. And, and we jumped at the opportunity to go out there with somebody that, that has experience doing it. footage you're about to see is actually the last morning of our North Dakota hunt. Uh, even though this footage is a little dark, it was worth putting on here. Good shooting. I mean, before it ever got good in daylight, we were well on our way to a limit.
Well, to start with on this hunt, we were trying to get all fancy and land these mallards and the decoys and everything. And it worked before it got good in daylight. But as it got more daylight, it was obvious that the ducks were seeing something. They didn't like something in our spread. So as the morning got on, we got a little bit more liberal with our shot calling. This is our last hunt in North Dakota. We've been up here all week and it's been kind of tough. We had three, three or four great hunts. You know, we had a bust morning here and there, but this is a good way to end it up. It was, it was sure worth the, the heartache this week, but um, we, it was a heartache. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we did good this week. Close out with the Mallard Apocalypse. <laughs> We had a heck of a trip to North Dakota and, and be looking for another episode of the hunts before this one in the near future. But also go over to combatinthewild.com, check out our website, like us on Facebook, and subscribe to our YouTube channel for to keep up with all our episodes.